The cashless society was part of the Great Reset, in which all physical money was erased. Now money only existed as a digital currency within the machine. Countries were flooded with economic relief for the pandemic. But the continual support and reinforcement given to the system would only lead to a crash. It was designed that way. The fear kept people believing and trusting in an illusion of their false legacy. But whoever controlled or created this digital currency had the ultimate investment. They owned us. Governments kept promising us we would go back to normal, but lockdowns crushed people's expectation to where the only entertainment was their black screen and the four walls within their containment cells. Society now only existed in the technological world. They sold technology to us as if it saved us from disease and solved all of our problems. But in reality, it destroyed humanity and finished the world as we know it. There was no other choice but to reset the system. With the cashless society in place, they brought in global credit scoring, the new economic model. From fear of loss and security, humans sacrificed their freedom into the satanic pit, blindly following their masters. Through the social credit score, humans have become the perfect product. The credit score gave an analysis to what sort of citizen you were. Are you a good citizen? How did you behave? You had to comply or you were penalised and your points were deducted. Eventually you were blacklisted and sent to the camps. With AI surveillance fully integrated into society and with the satellite systems in place, everyone was trapped. There was no way out. You couldn't hide. The cashless way was sold to us through the tech companies and made to look perfectly streamlined and effortless. We continued to comply with the capitalist beliefs because we were rewarded just enough to keep in the loop. But this was the trick. To keep their corruption a secret, we had to be the ones that hid it. And we did. We were bribed by the lie that their way was the only way. Through compliance, we made their darkness more powerful. It was the repeated pattern that they used on us over and over again. Because it worked. Until we became conscious, no one rebelled. But unless we rebelled, no one would become conscious. People resisted and fought with anger, but their souls were shattered from years of entrapment. People wanted anarchy, but their increasing powerlessness only led to self-destruction and dismantling of their spirits. The cashless society is the next step, but how we work with it determines the step that follows. Centralisation leads to mass control, and mass control is dictated to us by the few. We can't get distorted by the lies we are being told. We are the many, and through breaking out of old human mind patterns, we can create our own future. A future determined by us. But we must see that future now and constructively work at it. What world do you want to create? By letting psychopaths run our world? We have destroyed this incredible experience, full of potential, and allowed it to suffocate our light. We had a choice, and there was once hope, but now that's over. Consciousness surpasses death. But what destruction will you leave behind? We have a window of opportunity, and we have it now. Will we take it? Will you?